Hey, uh, I just figured I'd do a quick little show and tell here. Well, and to uh, kind of surmise the question I've been asking. What's the big deal about this uh, HDMI 2.1? Because I've been running at 120 hertz at 4K for a year now. This is the second television I'm doing it with. Um, I'm doing it with HDMI 2.0. So I asked the question, what's the big deal? Because I'm already doing it. Um, I cannot get high dynamic range out of Windows at 120 frames per second. I can only get it at 60. Um, just to prove that I'm running what I'm telling you I'm running. Uh, here, take a look. Wait for it. 120 hertz. Here, let me get a little closer so you can see. I'm doing it right there. I'm 4K at 120 freaking hertz. I'll show you another way I can prove it. Um, just, to, just to show, right here it says uh, I can't do uh, HDR, no streaming HDR video. But I can when I change the refresh rate to 60 hertz. But just to prove again that I'm running at 120 hertz, you can see my frame res or my uh, screen size, my resolution there. Come down ha. Again, there's my refresh rate at 120 hertz. I am not making this up, people. So stop telling me that I'm wrong. I ain't wrong. But still, if you got an answer for you know what the big deal is about this HDMI 2.1, yes, I know it's higher higher bandwidth. So I'm thinking it's only good for 8K or necessary for 8K. What I'm hoping is that I'll be able to get HDR content at 120 hertz because currently I can only do it at 60 hertz, and I'm going to prove it to you. Because uh, well, hey, I'm already here, so let's get on with it. But uh, these are my options for my monitor. I have well 23 to 120 hertz of options available. Now I, you saw before when I showed you the HDR content was not available. Watch what happens when I change it to 60. Now the screen got a whole lot darker, looks a whole lot different. I, I don't know, I guess the camera's picking it up. See, my refresh rate is now 60 hertz. I'm still at 4K resolution so, and, and color space is now high dynamic range. Just to prove it one more way. Now it says I can use HDR, and if I go into my settings, now it's streaming HDR, yes, use HDR, everything HDR, yes, is all available to me now. It will only run it at 60 hertz in HDR, but otherwise, yes, guys, yes, I fucking am running at 120 hertz. I've got a GTX 2070, a straight up 2070, that's all that it is, it ain't nothing special, it's not a super, it's, it's, it's older than that, so... It ain't nothing special. I've been doing this literally for a year. This is the second TV that I'm doing it with. So, uh, yeah, stop telling me no. And uh, here, watch. Watch, watch, watch. I'm going to do it again. 120 hertz. Bam. Yes, I am. And the difference is buttery smooth. Well, I yeah, this, this camera's only doing 60 hertz, so... Eh, clearly I'm having remote issues. <laughs> but anyway, you get the idea. And I mean, I hope that's enough proof because, uh, well, what more do you want? But, uh, yeah. So there you go. Um, like I said, um, my best guess is that it's it's got to be for 8K and, and yeah, because I'm already doing it. I'm already doing it on, on the, the 2.0 version, so... There you go. Proof was literally in the pudding and in this video. Cheers.